Please welcome the former WBA Super Featherweight Champion of the World, introducing Jason El Canito Sosa. The Super Featherweight Champion of the World, El Orgulloso Guerrero de la Región 93 in Cancun, introducing Miguel El Alacran Berchelt. It's all time to protect yourself at all times. Pelea duro, pelea limpio, toco la mano. Look across the ring, and he's a couple of weight classes above where you saw him on the scale. Well, Sosa doesn't look bad himself, right? His body looks big, he may be slightly bigger, even though he's a reach advantage compared to the knockout artist, Burchelt. will be established, everything's all off his jab, and I'm talking about Burchelt here. What kind of fight does he want to fight today? Sosa dipping down like that, Burchelt, wrong thing to do, because Burchelt talked about the fact that, you know what, I know what it's like to fight outdoors, but there's also a little breeze here, we're near the point type of chill here in Carson. Mm. Sosa has fought thus far. The first half of this first round, very patient. He's not loading up like you typically see him. Good at the fact that Sosa's invested in it. Sosa's trying to make Burchell think early on, and that wins this fight. Right there, you see. Oh, with that left hook. Sosa hurt Burchell with that left hook. Burchell stepped back. I saw the legs wobble just a tad bit. Nice right hand there from. Jason Sosa, he knows that Burchell can be hit, lands that left hook once again, but he's Burchell with a short left. And there, the jab of Burchell that sets up the rest of his offense. Burchell told me in the locker room, hey, it hit for the first time. That's when I know I'm in a fight. And it, both fighters are very active. And you see here that Burchell threw 10 more, but you see the efficient in Sosa. See, I like what Sosa's doing right now. He's bagging up Burchell. He knows that Burchell, they told us that his team, Sosa's team, it's a nice combination. Burchell throws back, and when he lands, he cracks with either the left or the right. And here we see Burchell, but he cannot get careless against Sosa, who trips there on his feet. Low blow there from Burchell. Sosa's yeah. still trying to get his legs That's under him, but trust me, he's still dangerous. He's looking to land that overhead right and that left hook. There you Don't see that. get the shot, he to do it, but he's looking for it. He's trying to get around that glove of Jason Sosa, lands another left hook. And here comes Sosa, but he's right in range. Exactly. You cannot be in mid-range with a guy like Burchell. In all the way out to get away from his punches. Oh, back right hand from Burchell, who follows up with a swivel of flurry of punches. And Once again, from Burchell, sends Sosa back. But once again, he just winds up and comes right into oh, short range. Oh, this is body shot from wow. Burchell. And look at the defense Burchell put on. Moved his head out of the way, came down with a vicious body shot, left hook to the body of Sosa. Reese has got to keep a close eye on Sosa. Takes a great shot, but he's taking a lot of punishment right now. Big second round for Miguel Berchez. Closes strong with a nice flurry on the face of Jason Sosa. Who's got a ton of heart? Oh, and another body shot. Yeah, that, that's what I was talking about before this fight started. Is yeah, Burchell is flawed, but he wants to be historical and be mentioned among the best pressure fighters. Yeah, that was a nice left hook to the body from Sosa. He's in a dog fight tonight against Burchell, and he keeps coming forward. Well, this is a good thing from Sosa. He's starting. He's trying to rest right now. If you're Sosa, you don't let Burchell rest. You press the issue like he's doing. Yeah, but when you press the issue, Dre, I hear what you said. You just deal with that left hook to the body and that got Burchell. Oh, nice uppercut from Jason Sosa, who follows up on Burchell, who blocks that and comes back with a flurry. He's got three amateur fights, so he doesn't have a lot of the stuff. You see some of the guys that do. So, 
he's learning on the job, even though it's a 10-year career. Oh, he's up for Chell. It seems like he's got four or five hands, the way he just lets them go. Ooh, nice right five, hand right there from Sosa. But then he steps back into range, and what does he Sosa going down to the body right here in round three, but once again, the answer from Burchell. And round three comes to an end. You know, round after round, and you know, Burchell's out throwing the, over the first three rounds. Pretty consistent in terms of the difference per round of 10. Before his last fight, Jason Sosa talked about being broke, talked about needing another big strike, and here he gets his chance against the champion. Burchell. There he is, mid-range with the combination oh. of the flying, DJ head and box. Burchell just mixes it up so well, he's so unorthodox, but those hooks upstairs and downstairs are punishing. He can't take this, he can't take this much punishment, and it looks right like on the money. And you just see the way that Sosa's walking in, Burchell goes to the set. I want to prove to you guys that I'm also a good defensive fighter. I'm not just an offensive machine, but sometimes, like you mentioned, when your offense is your defense, it will body. One thing I'm loving about Burchell is the body work. Everybody knows I love body work, but it opens up the head shot yep. like that. Now your opponent has to worry about oh. Impressive work from Burchell. He looks strong. Here we see Burchell wow. doing what Burchell does. He just throws that. and he lands wherever he can land. Vicious body shot right there. That goes Sosa. Sosa. Do a body shot. Four, five, look at me. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. You want to continue? Walk that way and come back to me. It's over. Come here. Purposes looks over for Chell just wants to put him down to the body. Oh, he is. Neglect what got you there. Go right back down to the body. There it, oh, be over. There it there is. There it is. There it is. Sosa can take a shot, but his corner and the referee have to look. They need to protect him. him. There it is. To save him. Exactly what we were talking about. The corner needed to look after the fighter. He will keep fighting all night long as long as you let him. And the corner. He is the winner by way of knockout. He is still. The WBC Super Featherweight Champion of the World, Miguel El Alacran.